waffles, 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 waffles. Hello and welcome. This is Waffles1738 here. Um, back with another video, and basically in this video I'm going to be doing some expedition missions and some Sunset Canyon in the uh, in the um, fighting uh, option, I guess. So I'm going to start off with my daily Sunset Canyons, which I have four of. Well, and I haven't done this in a while on this account, so it's just going to be <coughs> easy. So it just does this to see my power and match it up. So I'll easily take these out. Yeah, they're, they're just going down completely. So one's already down, the second one permanent's gone, basically. And then, come, yeah, <coughs> that was quite easy. So my power is 1.229 million. So now it will match me up with some more people. I'll go for this guy because he's a little less than me. So I'll, I should be able to beat him. He only has four March Qs as well, but I don't know what his commanders are like. It's really annoying actually because in this you realise that there are actually active people in really small alliances. Like I found out there's this alliance with 12 million power in our kingdom, with a 10 million power person, and he he's just completely inact. Like he's active, really strong, but he won't talk to anyone. He won't answer any mails. So it's just owning an alliance with all these 100k people who don't actually play the game anymore. So it's completely pointless in being there. So I think we're quite easily going to take that. But my awesome man was double teamed, so he's gone. There, Joanna Vark is really low, so I'll be able to take her easily. And then the cow cow's just got quadruple team, so he's not going to survive very long. He might take out my Julius Caesar though, actually. I don't think he will, no. So, there we go. <clears throat> we are going up the rankings currently. Got two more in this. I'll go for the one million. So this alliance here, there, it's really annoying because there's quite strong alliances, but they're not going into KVK, so they're just useless, really. They're they're weight right now because they're not actually gonna help in our KVK. So we're just waiting for level 5 passes in KVK to open right now. So hopefully they will open soon and then we can see what will happen in the next stage. Again, my Ozman is getting double teamed. He always gets double teamed, it seems. So he's always the first of my commanders to go out. Which is sometimes annoying, but he is my weakest commander, so I don't really mind. Oh, but all my commanders are quite weak, so I don't know if we'll be able to win this. Because I think my Julius Caesar will be taken out. I've still got my Mina and my Markswoman on half health, and my um, Cleopatra's on half health, but she her levels are really not that good. Oh, Julius Caesar has gone now, so I've taken out their Scipio. It's three on one, so we should be able to win against their Dragon Lancer. But he's put him with... Um, Spearman, which he probably shouldn't do. He should probably put them with cavalrys because he's best with cavalrys. So that might have been able to take out Cleopatra if he did that. So I got my last attempt. Then I will move on to doing. Um, oh, I'll go for him. 1.5, 1.05. So I will move on to expedition after this. How many march juice has he got? I think he's only got four. Um, yeah, he's only got four. I should be able to win, but he's done mixed armies, so I don't really know if that works too well because you could just get a full cav army because most armies have like full everything. So with his Herman, he could have just gone full archers, which would have been better instead of putting Mango and all the others. So the thing is, at the top, his Julius Caesar is getting triple teamed. And then my Julius Caesar is winning a one on one, but my Osman's got double team. So now my Julius Caesar is getting triple teams. Oh, and it's um, a 4v2 now. We should be able to win this. Shouldn't be that hard. So he's just done mixed armies for everything, which he probably shouldn't do. He should probably have set armies of them, like Herman, full archers and everything. 
and Scipio may be full. Well, Scipio can have anything really because he's leadership. So he can. He's good with any units. I think my Julius Caesar's going to be taken out. He's got Charles Marto, so I don't really know why I've had them. They're both defending, so they don't have any attacking things on them. They don't have attacking buffs, they just defend. Which is good, I guess. Yeah, his Skippy is going to go down pretty quickly, being Trepidy. But he got all of mine low, that was not too far off. We're going to go into Expedition now. Uh, I'm going to try and complete level 57. That's so I'm going to go full cab with Mina, because he's going to have It says it should be a piece of cake. Hopefully it is. So I'm just going to take all two dead Charles Martel. They have two Charles Martels, two Richards, and one Julius Caesar. Rick, uh, yeah, that, that's, that's a defensive. They're going to be good. Putting up all their shield things, their shield power-ups. So I'm just basically sending all my units to attack one of theirs. So we can pick them off one by one, which should be good. Uh, Charles Martel's going down pretty quickly, should be out of battle, but my March one is getting hit heavily, um, nearly a half health already. I think this is going better for us at the moment, so... We should be able to win this, really. It's a piece of cake, so I hope it is. Oh, 16... I think the Charles Martel we're attacking right now had the most troops at the start. So I'm just going to select all my units ready to attack this Richard right here. Alright, so we're, we're, all my units are going to go and attack Richard. I probably should have targeted the Richards first because I think they're the best commanders out of all of them. So, all my units are still fighting, but my Malchman is about to go down. But all, all my commanders are on pretty high health still. So, yeah, my march one has gone down. So we've each got one down. Um, I don't know who they have as their second breeds. It's really confusing because you just see all these numbers coming up and all the red and all the blue. <laughs> I don't really understand half the time. But it's just confusing because you don't know who's doing what. I don't know if we, we will actually win this. I don't know, because... Alright, we've taken one of their riches down. The Studio Caesar is... Let's select two units. Oh, I can't even select them. What's going on? Wait, where is he? Oh, I can't... I'll, I'll select Richard, that's fine. Because I'm pretty sure Studio Caesar will just suicide by attacking, anyway. So... Yeah, this Rich is going. They're, they're all pretty low. I don't know if we'll run out of time. Now. Because. Yeah, I've got his Rich to go. I might start targeting his Charles Martin. To get him low. Let's all go and attack. Let's all go and attack Charles Martin. Yeah, I think it's. Because. I don't know if we'll be able to do this. Got 20 seconds left. No, I don't. I don't do this. It's gonna be really close, whatever. If we do it. All. 10 seconds left, and his Julius Caesar's gone out. Three seconds. One second. Oh my god, that was literally so close. What? Like, if I had one more second, he would have been gone. I think I've just got to level up my commanders a bit until I can go into that again, so, yeah. So, alright. So, thanks for watching. I hope you did enjoy me doing Sunset Canyon and also doing um, uh, Expedition. Hopefully next time I do an Expedition video, I'll be able to take um, that one down. It was the time. If I got one more second, I would have been able to do it. But thanks for watching. Please do leave a like on the video and subscribe to me. It will mean a lot. Thanks for watching.